electrocardiographic observation of the heart began with Eindhoven's limb leads. This was followed by Goldberger's augmented unipolar limb leads. Then Wilson's chest leads. The observable area of the heart has expanded with each generation. Now, Nihon Koden's new technology, synthesized 18-lead ECG, illuminates new regions of the heart to provide critical cardiac information and help you identify invisible ischemia using Cynic Eye. Standard 12-lead ECG tests do not record the right side leads, V3R, V4R, and V5R, or the posterior leads, V7, V8, and V9, because of the troublesome procedure and lack of devices which can record 12 leads plus six additional leads at the same time. To solve this problem, Nihon Koden has worked with leading cardiologists to develop a breakthrough method of greatly simplifying the process. This is Cynic Eye. Cynic Eye uses only standard resting ECG electrode placement to accomplish its task. No additional electrodes or special procedures are required. Simply perform a standard 12-lead ECG and get immediate access to the synthesized leads of the right ventricle and posterior wall. Here's an example of synthesized 18-lead waveforms. Six synthesized leads waveforms at the right and standard 12-lead ECG waveforms at the left and center. Cynic Eye, synthesized 18-lead ECG is based on a Nihon Koden patented technique. The synthesized 18-lead ECG is obtained in two steps. First, a heart vector is calculated from the actual 12-lead ECG. Next, waveforms for leads V7, V8, and V9, as well as V3R, V4R, and V5R are synthesized from the calculated heart vector. Here is an actual V4R waveform with right ventricular infarction. There is almost no difference between the actual and the synthesized waveforms. Other leads also showed good correlation. Early detection of ischemia is important in treating ACS. Cynic Eye Nihon Koden synthesized 18-lead ECG technology 